test, test, ah, uh, whoa, that's loud, ah, uh, da, 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 da. a little loud for me, how about that, ah, uh, that looks a little better, let me turn out the gain a little bit more, I'm learning things about microphones and such, so, okay, that actually, you know what, I think that looks good, okay, if I talk like this, it should be fine, I don't want to be too loud, I don't like being <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, anyway. We've got this awesome match between Liam and Shazam. Both players, like, kind of... I, I would be happy if either of these two get on. I honestly see a lot of promise of both these players. Liam, definitely on the come up for sure. From his uh, tournaments that he's come, he's gotten some fairly good placements and such. And then Shazam, he's always just been working on that Ryu and such. He's been coming closer every time against some, some people. Wish I could say more about Shazam, but yeah. He's been here, he's got that experience. Well that big experience to take out take on this Ness invasion. Ness invasion, sure. Okay, let me yeah, I am good. I'm just double checking my audio again. I'm good. So far a pretty even game. Nice to broken. Forest and knock Liam to the platform. Oh the falling upper and Shazam, I'm not expecting that one. Yeah, upper is fairly fast from this too for a landing tool. Great reaction to the roll behind Shazam. That was good. And he gets the show you can. Avoiding that back throw. N now he's at that percent where back throw kill from about center stage now I'd say. Hmm, about not really. I think like a little bit more rage would do that. Or an up air with that. Great out here. Yeah, that up air is just so fast. You know, I li I like uh, doing frame data and such, but uh I'm not going to do that to him, but, uh, yeah, it's a good move. Got Hojo, that Hojo can keep him out a little bit more. Right out, Alice controlling his face right there, great back air. He grabs him right out of the focus. Reaction. Alright, reset. Get fire! See, so that's something that I really like about Liam's Ness, is that he when he gets the PK fire, he knows that people have the ability to SDI out of that PK fire, and he'll sometimes just go for a nair to cover their option instead and just get like safer damage. And plus, it's safe on shield, so even if they SDI out in shield, he can fade away out of it after, depending on uh, what the uh, opponent's out of shield options are. And this match, is close to that Shoryuken, it's gonna do it for game for the first game. All right. Big cash on that landing right there. Shazam is gonna take that first game. Looking nice. One of these two is gonna make at least top 12 today. We'll see what happens here. Game two. Um, game two. He's looking at battlefield, and I honestly can see that. Um, I'm thinking about it. This gives place avenues for uh, Ryu to uh, land with focus for, for the most part, because upper is not going to beat through it. So the way that uh, Liam's going to want to counteract that is, well, that that's also really nice. But um, if he's landing with focus to land specifically on the platform, up air is not going to get through it. But he can shark underneath him. Another thing, if he needs to break the focus, he can go for forward air. I I'm just thinking about how the platforms uh, help Ryu. That's probably not the most productive thing to do. I like that up there, actually. Let's set him back up there. And the end's been doing a good job getting the, getting the early percent lead. Beautiful down smash. Is that going to take a stock? No. Just barely in a cap. That just barely two framed him, I think. That was interesting. Okay. Probably going to look for that kill now. Shazam might want to watch out for that. Okay. Air beats the Shokunetsu. Interesting. Yeah, that priority from uh, Lucas. Uh, holy mess. Wow. Okay, fourth throw. Doesn't offer the pivot there. Not thinking that's enough time. It covers the uh, rising uh, Tatsu with a beautiful, with a good nair right there. I don't want to say beautiful so much. Double nair. It's fast, so that's another way he can deal with it, really. Um, just double nair, honestly. The hit stun on uh, Focus isn't too bad that he won't get stalled out of it, and he's keeping that percent going. Alex just hasn't found the way out of the corner. 
quite yet. Taking advantage of that platform, there's a quarter. Down smash, like two frame them right there. That that time was definitely two frame. Or just or just Ryu doesn't snap. Sure just... you kids, so good. Beat up that back air, wow. He's a back. There's a dash attack, I think he wanted to... I think he wanted to kill right there. Okay. He's trying to get to confirm here. Another dash attack, so it's gonna send him that way. I think one more dash attack to kill. Fourth throw, get him back off stage again. Oh, almost a hard up tilt underneath that. That forward is gonna go right through that. Oh, looking for the down air at that time. There's a down smash. What the? That was fresh. And Ryu has rage. But it doesn't matter. It takes the stock. It gets the job done. Even if it does. There's a back air from Liam. He's looking poised. Yeah, that down smash covers from Liam. For the, uh... Tassi. That's good. Oh my goodness, that's so good. Buffer, the buffered air dodge is going to seal Shazam's fate right there. We're going to go on to a game three situation. Wow. Yeah, that down smash is just really good. That's something I saw much in game one that actually helped him a lot in game two. I mean, a lot. Can he lose a stock due to a buffered air dodge? Hmm. I'm gonna see the switch to Cloud. I wonder what Alex is looking for here. Um, I think he's looking for more range and in, in uh, close-up neutral for the most part. Maybe. Plus Liam is uh, Liam has he might have also felt that Liam was covering his options as Ryu really well, like landing options. Cloud just has better landing options. I mean, he has his go-to pogo stick, so is that? It's nice. Liam's keeping the stage so far. Damn, yeah, not getting caught by that nair, but I'm reading him out of that. Nice. It's just looking like game two so far. Liam with the advantage. Oh my goodness. I do have to credit one thing on before that that tech punish right there. Good. That missed tech punish. That's smart. But uh, I do want to credit one thing that I have seen from out a couple times is his recovery mix up and his timing on it. They've been really good in some situations, and he's prevented himself from getting gimped for the most part. Except for, you know, um, present Tatsu, but... Yeah. Liam just really good on that timing on getting that. Alright. Just trying to keep away, not build up, not lose, take too much damage here. Liam... Playing it safe at the same time. Okay? I like that positioning right there. Right there, get out of the way of that downer and just punish him on landing. Cause there's no hitbox in front of Cloud when he does the downer, so that can be something to punish if you're fast enough to get out of the way. Something I would recommend. Oh, Liam! There's for some reason the PK Thunder didn't get canceled up with that downer. If that connected, that would have been Cloud's life. Right there in the blasted, gone, evaporated. There's a dash attack. I think that was a fresh dash attack too, so that's gonna take this off. So it's hitting at 56%, a bit about even here. Surprise PK Rocket from Liam right there. Great, uh, good power shield from Shazam to prevent taking too much damage from that. That thing is powerful for those who are new to this game, PK Rocket. You don't see it too often, but when you do, that thing will charge right at you and do so much damage. And that's the thing too, when he's off stage like that, and when Ness is off stage too, he can take great advantage of that too. Okay, Liam setting up the edge right there, using the PK Thunder to force the limit usage right there. Try to cover his get up with down smash, just barely doesn't get that. Back, get that percent up a little bit more with forward throw before going for the back back throw. Covers the jump there nicely in corner. Jam does make it back, outspacing with that back air. There's a back throw on that dash attack, and that's gonna do it. Wow. Yeah.